Hello everybody, happy October, and welcome to Graveyard Keeper. I thought this would be a great game to try out for the first of October, or whenever I decide to upload this. It's described as sort of like a Harvest Moon, Stardew Valley, mixed with spooky shit. So, I thought that'd be fun. Let's try it out. Ooh. New game. I mean, you can't go wrong with this. Harvest Moon, Slash Stardew Valley, 23-6. It's an ordinary day. And, oh, well. Given everyday routine, there's a place for loving and feeling loved. Santa? Especially when you know that someone misses you. <laughs> well, that escalated quickly. What happened? Where is everything? Calm down. You merely turned a page in your life. A whole new chapter awaits you ahead. But I need to go home. Can I go home? New task. There's always a way to go get home. Hmm. Let me see. Your new home is a graveyard. What? Does that mean I'm dead? Yeah, bro. It means you're a graveyard keeper now. I need to go home to my love. Then you need, then you need to be a good graveyard keeper. Dig up Gary. He'll help you sort everything out. Okay. Is Gary the donkey? I've seen that donkey on the title. Who? The strange vision. What is this nightmare? Okay, let's find Gary. New task. Okay. <laughs> Look at our little walk. He is just to open, is to cook. I... Ooh, it's so pretty. What's this? And that. Gary? Is that you? F. Holy shark! I'm a skull! Are you Gary? <laughs> Why do you think I'm Gary? The man with a red eye told me that I needed to dig up Gary. Red eye? I remember! Oh, sod! That's right, I'm Gary! How did you find me? The man told me that you'd answer all my questions. Good, good. But first, let me ask you. Who are you and where? The Sad Alley. Bruh. Must be dreaming. None of this can be real. You're the new graveyard keeper! <laughs> what else do I remember? Let me think. While I'm a skull, <laughs> I hop. I remember that sound. Let's go check it out. The bell? Point. Everything is so strange. None of this makes sense. Well, I think it'll be better if I wait for you here. Don't scare the poor or whatever. I definitely remember a bell and a donkey. Something is very wrong with that animal. He could be dangerous. Why are you sending me, though? You're the one that's already... Well, I guess I'm already dead, too. Okay, fair enough. Hello. Donkey! <laughs> Got a first corpse from town! Nope, that's not your voice. Wow! It's a talking donkey! Oh, well. That's... <laughs> Can understand me? Let's talk! Who are you? I'm a donkey! I'm cheap labor. This card isn't mine, so I have to work for the capitalist bastard who owns it. Fair? Well, not really. I can only want five carrots a day. The situation is deeply humiliating. 
You know where I'm coming from, right, comrade? The bastard pretends that he doesn't understand anything I'm saying. Anyway, I need to go back to the town. You get rid of this one, and I'll bring you a new one. What a strange land this is. Okay. Hi, Mr. Donkey. Hi, Mr. Skull. Hey! What are you staring at? Grab that juicy corpse while it's still fresh! Oh, it's like decaying. What for? I feel like we should take it to the morgue. I don't remember exactly why. Exactly, exactly. But I'm pretty sure it'll be fun. It might be profitable. Oh, I'm going to puke. Let's do it! Whoa. Use E. Okay. Whee! I might want to use a controller with this because so far this mouse does nothing. Okay. So, and I like this place. It feels like home or something. I don't really know what I said, but the body on the opsopsy table. And what's next? Oh, yes, that's some flesh from that corpse. That should be good for starters. What? No! Right. Sure, sure, it's not right. How could I forget? Because I'm a talking skull with amnesia! Is it right that you don't know where you are? Is it right that I'm a skull? Nothing is right here! So shut up! So shut the side up and do what I tell you. Put the fucking corpse on the table. You promise you'll tell me how to get home? Need to trade the meat in the village tavern for a beer! Talking skulls never lie. I mean, I don't know if that's true, but you seem trustworthy, and then bring the beer to me. Okay. You unlock new technology and got blueprint. Preparation place. Blueprint. Palette. Extraction. Flesh. Ew. Boop. Autopsy. Body parts. Body is at 95. We're going to do this. F is to work. You like new technology and got create a burger, create a sandwich, create baked meat. Gross. That's disgusting. Y'all get used to it. So what should I do with the corpse? I don't know. Let's bury it. Take the corpse and I'll wait for you in the graveyard. You can poof? That's, that's, that's wild. Toxy hopsy poofs, it's foggy out now. So much is happening. Hey. Let's bury it! Use the blueprint desk at the graveyard mark a site for the grave, then dig it with your shovel. Carefully put the body, or whatever remains of it, in the grave. Bury. Decorate. Warning! Do not use goat skulls and upside down stars for your decoration. That just makes me want to do it even more! Uh... Aren't these little trees? I don't want to dig up the trees. Uh, can I just... <laughs> We can just push them around. Let's build a grave site. Oh. Uh. Put you in a nice new spot. How about right next to where you are? Dig in a grave. I'm gonna make up a song for this game. It didn't look like you were burying it. It looked like you were just slapping him down. Like, stay in there. This burial certificate, I remember. Money. Alcohol. Were you the last gravekeeper and this is why you know this stuff? Alcohol. Hmm. I sure used to like it. A lot. Oh, sod. Here comes the bishop. He's your boss. He's the one telling me to do this? Oh, oh, I know. Ask him about the burial certificate. He should know... something. I believe now. I'll be in the morgue waiting for my beer! Hop. <laughs> Damn me, I'm so tired. Wait. Damn me, I'm so tired. 
Why? Well, I don't. I don't know. I, I fucked up. Hi. Oh dear, the new keeper. Hmm. We've been expecting him for thirty years, but he pretends that there's nothing wrong. Who? Oh. Me? I just got here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but your graveyard is a mess. There's no way I'm promoting you to cleric until you fix it. Bro, I just got here, and I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, current location name. Location. Important information. Location information. The graveyard quality. Little skull with a leaf. The church appeal. Etc. Repair graves to increase the graveyard's overall quality, but I like this one. It looks spooky. You'll probably need special resources to do that. Wooden marker. As soon as your graveyard quality is at least five skulls with leaves, I'll be pleased. I'll be pleased to promote you. You look like a spiritual leader, I'm, and I'm a good judge of character. <laughs> well. I don't believe you. I'm good at everything! That's why I was chosen to represent this his will. <laughs> Your predecessor used to keep his stuff in a trunk somewhere here. You should check it. I'll come by next week. In fact, I'll come here every purple sun in a circle. Maybe I'm not dreaming. D did I eat something? Oh, he's waiting. What should I say? Why is it you come here? It's part of my duty, the unpleasant part. It's kind of an old tradition. I don't know much about the traditions and rituals. I'm just here to represent his might and glory. <laughs> I have one tiny question. What is this burial certificate? As soon as a body has been laid to rest, you can trade its burial certificate for money at the village tavern. Oh, uh, I'm not the keeper. I was going home from work. Yeah, I need to go home. There's a talking skull. He forced me to butcher a corpse. Ha <laughs> <laughs> fine joke. I'm a humorist myself. Here's one. Who is BB? Big boss? Who? I am! Ha <laughs> ha! Chuckle, chuckle. Blessed and beautiful. I hate you. Can I- is there an awkward laugh option? I'm gonna ignore you. How can I fix? Just repair all the graves! It wouldn't take me even an hour, but it's your job. Alright. Alright, well. If you run out of repair kits while you're fixing the graveyard, you can always craft new ones. No. Oh. To craft new items, you'll need to unlock the relevant technology. This costs tech points. Press tab to open the technology tree. Ooh, trees. Red points represent your handcrafting skills and your ability to work with materials. Green represents knowledge about the nature of the things and nature itself. Blue points represent spiritual knowledge, the marital world. You'll get your first at the study table in the church basement. You're in parents, simply by doing anything. Also, you can get points by studying new items at a special table. Ooh, special. Stone stockpile. Gathering stone. You can collect small piece of stone from a small rock or get a huge piece from a big one. Timber. Chop down a small tree to get one log. You can collect sticks from dry bushes. Oh, it's a, it's a skill tree. I don't have any of... Oh, I got one. I got a green point. What's this? Is there any point in having my mouse? Right click seemed to work. Ooh, I want this. And I want this. And I want that, that, and that. Where, wait, wait, where did it all go? There were more tools. Uh oh. I don't think they stayed. We don't want these bushes. Oh. Oh, uh, he? There's a body. It's, I don't know what that means. I don't 
don't have a gravestone. I don't have a fence. Ah, I'm sorry. Oh, my quality is negative 27. That's not very good. They'll never promote me to a bishop. Oh, the fog's going, boy. Oh, uh, it wants me to go in there, sir. Bye bye. Bye. Oh. I'm Oh, does it want me to go to the bar to get money? What is this? Is this farmland? I want a farm. I want a little watering can. Who are you? Oh, 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 oh. Intel Mal? What? Oh. Uh, today is purple sun in a circle. Tomorrow looks like it's blue moon. Then male symbol, then little demon thing, then like a little pinchy claw, and then female, and then purple sun in a circle again. Ooh. Can I run? No. I, I don't know the buttons yet. We'll figure it out. Ooh, cabbages! Those are pretty. The dead horse. Yo! What it do? It's your boy. Graveyard keeper or whatever. Welcome to the dead horse tavern. I am... How can I help you? I came from the graveyard. I woke up here today and things have been crazy since then. Oh, no. Sorry, how could I not have recognized you? Good, this is good. I don't know. How I don't recognize you. Things are looking bright for our small village. When are you planning on opening the church? I need to fix the graveyard first, I guess? Sure, sure. It's been a while since I took care of it. So let's get down, to, get down to business, shall we? How can I help you? Uh, about this burial certificate. The bishop told me that, uh, you would buy this certificate. Yeah, he's right. As the head of the village, according to the ancient contract, I have to trade it for money. Wait, you're the head of the village? Are you on the bar? Of course, only if I have any money. What do you mean? You obviously have business. Uh, the village is going through hard times. We're short on money. But as soon as you open the church, pilgrims will bring lots of shiny coins to the village. Oh. You know how I can get back home? Can you tell me where I am? Because I really need to get back home. My darling will be super worried. You're at the dead horse. Okay, it looks medieval. Maybe I traveled through time. And what year is it? Here? What do you mean? The time it takes for the Earth to make one revolution around the sun? About 365 days? Oh, you've been listening to the astrological global nonsense. Uh, no. Everybody knows that the Earth is flat. But I get you. It's 200 after the ancient contract and 210 after... Never mind. And what is the name of our beloved kingdom? Kingdom? And it's... It is definitely not beloved here in the village. It's called the kingdom. Do you have any other questions? I'd like to trade you some fresh meat. Meat is a delicacy in our village. I'd be glad to buy it. I just need some to see the royal meat stamp on it. What? Many years ago, there was an accident with an inappropriate meat. Ever since, all meat must be approved by royal authority. And I don't need any trouble with the town. Does your meat have a stamp? Uh, no. I don't even want to know where you can get unauthorized meat, but wow, it really looks good. But without my, without a stamp, my hands are tied. 
Can I get the stamp? Bolo, bolo, oh, you can send bolo, bolo, the bolo. form to the royal court through the mailbox near your church. It'll cost you a bundle. Bolo, 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 well, there's bolo, another way. Bolo. I'll tell you just because we're neighbors. Come closer. Bolo, 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 there's this guy bolo. called Snake. He has a fake royal stamp. But uh, to be honest, I haven't seen him for a while. You can ask Miss Charm. She comes here every female day. And then she can help you find the snake. Thanks! Uh leave. Oh, keeper. Could you kindly take this letter to our local blacksmith result? <laughs> Sure, where can I find him? <laughs> Southeastern corner of the village. Cool beans, who are you? <laughs> what up, Miss Chang? You must be the new graveyard keeper. So I've been told, but how did you know? <laughs> oh, if, li if you lived as long as I have, you've probably learned how to read people too. <laughs> but where's my manners? I'm Miss Chang. Frederick's wife. Nice to meet you questions about oh, oh you better talk to my husband he's in charge around here oh fuck but uh, he really does like to talk all i can do is sell you some recipes i like recipes what you got Better talk. Okay. Ah, trait. I don't have money, but you do. Okay. Wait. Uh, can I tr trade the contract? Oh, you only have ten silver. And I don't know how much silver is worth compared to. I'm guessing that's bronze or copper. But I don't have money either, so. I can't talk to y'all. What to do? Let's see, exit. Hey, right, we gotta go somewhere. Uh, escape. Oh, controls. Interact work. Attack with sword of space. Open game menu is tab, character is I. Oh, those are a lot of buttons. Hopefully I can just get to them by pressing tab. Roll, dude. Uh, we have, oh, there's where the tools went. Gary, get a beer. Graveyard Keeper, that's me. Get back home, Bishop, reach five. Donkey! <laughs> he delivers bodies from a left wing stable. Uh, find a stamp. Bring the letter to the blacksmith. I. Hopefully it's open. Alright, so this one has a simplified tool. Thing going on. It doesn't look like a blacksmith. Can I just like. Does the map tell me? Home, kitchen garden, more graveyard, wheat farm, village. Right. So down. Okay, creepy dudes. Uh, this path? Yeah. I like the, like, OG Harvest Moon kind of, um, tool style where you have to pick the tool and then do it yourself. Oh, hey, what are you staring at? Nothing, just looking around. I think I'm the keeper of a local graveyard. I ask who you are? Unfortunately, I changed my accent again. I'm the local blacksmith. My name is Grezel. Here's a letter. I have a letter for you from... Fordrick. 
Of course, one minute away, and he can't be bothered to come himself. I guess old habits never die. Thank you, sorry for my, my nagging, it seems my new habit. Slimes again. Podrick has asked me to get rid of them. I don't have the time for those pesky little green bastards. But maybe you can help. Take this rusty sword as, and an energy potion. Sword is broken, but you can repair it with a waystone on the grinder right behind me. Oh. Keep the weight whetstone. Maybe you'll need it to repair your shovel sometime. If you manage to kill them, just bring me their remains and I'll spare you some materials. They should be right up the other side of my house, near the puddles. Different actions and the same spend energy in the game, not the same. Crafting, gathering, and fighting take energy. Fighting has been known to take health as well. You can always refill your health and energy with food and potions. Sleep will also restore health. Uh, it looks like that one's locked. Uh, shovel. Yes. Work it. Let me work it. Alright, so... Ah! Yeah! 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 Ew! Poopity goo! Yeah! 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 Ow! Yeah! 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 Because are very necessary! I did it! Good job! Take this whetstone. They're shopping your broken tools and they'll be good as new. Ew. Okay. You know what? I like to work with metal myself. Where can I find some more? Sure. Find metal in the swamp soil. There's a huge swamp in the west across the river, so there's not a mine. I used to collect all there before the bridge collapsed. Ooh. Furnace, iron ingot, and gathering in swamp ore. A rare piece of iron forged in the shape of an ingot. Or it can be collected from small deposits on boggy soil. What do you got? I don't know the value of these things yet. Alright, let's go back to... Let's go back to the bar, I guess. Yo, it's your boy. It's good to know how to use a sword. You told me about how you helped him. How? Y'all got phones back here? Here, have a beer. It's on the house. Sweet. Now I can give that to little Mr. Skelly Bones. Oh, there's a cat. I want a cat. She will protect me from demons. She is the mightiest of cats. Wow, these footprints literally last forever. I kinda hope they disappear the next day because... I don't want footprints to just like, stay there forever. <laughs> oh! It ended right there. Ooh. Ah! What are you doing over there? Come here! Happy bed! I was at the village. This place is so weird, but it feels so real. Everybody is okay with me just appearing out of nowhere. Sorry! You're stealing my thoughts! Stealing! I remember there's a cellar in your cottage. Some provisions must be stored there. Ooh, gathering edible mushroom. Can be gathered at groves and forests. Can be cooked at home. Gathering berry. Can be collected from bushes, has a sweet and sour taste. Apple can be gathered from wild apple trees. <laughs> Wait, exactly! I remember making bread from it! And pies, mmm, sweet berry pies. And 
great dough, pastry dough, and bread. Toast. Onion toast. Oh, that's good with beer side. You know what? I need a beer. This is beginning to feel like a one-sided relationship. Bring me beer and I'll tell you a lot of important stuff like how you can get home. Questions? I'm gonna get home. Yeah, can you tell me? <laughs> it was rhetorical! Do I look like a magic cat with answers? <coughs> well, technically, yeah. Side, you smart ass. I'll be waiting for you for that beer at my place. No beer, no answers. Ah, you want poof at your place? In my place? Oh, it's becoming day. I think we should go to bed. And that's also where I'll leave it off in this episode. Ooh, look at us gaining all that energy. Oh, we... Oh. Ah, it's a fucking ghost. Ah, so refreshed. This is not good. Not good at all. Who do you think you are? I'm the new graveyard keeper? Question mark? Exclamation point? Startling ghost scream? Hooray, a kipper! Wow, I've been here for mm, how long? I'm York! Hi. I'm so lonely. Poor, poor me. It's too bad you're here. Wait! No! On the contrary! I'm very glad to see you! But we do have a rather unpleasant fellow buried here. I'd really like to have a new neighbor instead. Sound like something you can help us with? I'm not exactly sure why I'm here, actually. Gary only told me about burying bodies. You're York, and he's Gary. Funny. Oh, uh, the half-dead skull! That jealous bastard. <laughs> he can only dream of what a peaceful rest we're having. Who am I kidding? It's terrible here, especially that guy down in the lower right corner grave. He's so mean. Could you just get rid of him? Just dig him up and throw him in the river. And even give you this license that I stole back when I was alive. What license? That license. You're such a dummy. To dig up a corpse. Need a license. The old keeper used to buy them through the mailbox near the church. Oh, well, bye. <laughs> okay, I wasn't expecting a ghost to pop up after we fell asleep. Anyway, that was the first episode of Gravekeeper. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a thumbs up, comment below what you think, and if you'd like to see me play more. I probably am because I'm pretty interested in this game so far. Um, yeah. Well, in the next one, it looks like we'll be giving the beer to Gary and seeing what he knows, and then possibly digging up a body and throwing it in the river. You know, typical farming graveyard things. <laughs> I hope there's farming in this game. I heard there was. Um, anyway, so far, I like it, but we'll see. Anyway, I've been Katie Scoob, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye-bye!